you hear that? My knee just cracked. Hi. Really quick before I actually get started with this video, I wanted to mention this video is sponsored by Fabletics. Thank you so much to them for sponsoring. I'm sure y'all know who Fabletics is already. They make super cute workout clothes, which I'm wearing their leggings right now and I actually love them. So I'm going to talk about them more later in the video, but if you would like to get super good deals like $24 for two pairs of leggings, that's crazy. I have pasta sauce on my face. Keep watching. Yeah. <laughs> But it's not my bangs and my appearance right now are not it uh i'm gonna get ready real quick even though i should be leaving right now <laughs> i'm ready for school definitely breaking dress code and i'm very late so actually i don't eat anything during school like ever so i will see you when i get home hi yo i my hair looks so bad i am finally home it is 1 30 usually i get home at like 12 40 no earlier than that i usually get home at like 12 30 but today i stayed after school to film a video and also i just took my very last online final anyways i'm very hungry i usually don't go this long without eating so i think i'm gonna make some avocado toast if anyone says anything about me being being basic i'll block you but i just have some avocados that i need to use before they go bad avocado toast is one of my favorite things in the whole entire world i've been like craving it a lot recently even though i like eat it pretty often but yeah that sounds dank so while i make this i just wanted to talk to you a little bit <laughs> um so that i feel like it oh, i need to let this out come here puppy I'm back. Anyways, I just wanted to talk about food and stuff like that. I really, really like watching these types of videos. I don't know why, it's just something that I like watch often. It's one of those things that I literally like search up on YouTube is like what I eat in a day. It's just because I think it's interesting to see what people eat. Anyways, I really like watching what I eat in a day, but the reason I don't ever do them is because people are just really weird and think that they can like tell you what's wrong with like what, ooh, that is bad. Oh no. I just don't think it is anyone's place ever to like judge or talk about what other people are eating or like how much other people are eating. Okay, that one's a little better. I'll have to cut some like pieces out because that's I'm not trying to eat that avocado. So I don't know if you have an issue with like what I eat or how much I eat, that's fine. But I don't need to hear about it because I don't really care. I eat enough for me and I am healthy for me and that is good enough. Next thing, I want to talk about my breakfast, I guess. I usually, honestly, don't eat breakfast because I am too tired in the morning and I like can't get up and make something. But because I knew that I was gonna be at school longer today, I made breakfast. So I usually get home. Long story short, I explained this for like way longer than I needed to, but I get home early from school every day. I am not at school all day, so therefore I'm not going like a super long time without eating. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I'm fine to eat in the morning. Like it doesn't make me sick or anything like that. I just don't really, like I am too lazy and I'm too tired to actually get up and do something. If you're wondering what I'm doing right now, probably not. I'm just mashing up avocado in this. And then the next step is the most important, at least for me. I think some people think this is gross, but I don't. I've just always done this because that's what my mom always, do, always does. I put mustard like, and I mix it with the avocado. I think it's really good, but Alex saw me doing this and he was like, um, that's gross. And I was like, I think it's good and it just adds more flavor. I'm using the Dave's thin sliced bread. Um, I don't know, I really like Dave's bread. It's my favorite, so. Another thing while I'm waiting for my bread to cook, I like to put seasoning salt in my avocado mix. I really like salty food, so I'll add some of this. That was kind of a lot. I feel like people watch these to like get new recipes and stuff, but like I just want to let you guys know that I'm like not a cook or a chef whatsoever. My meals are pretty basic. Final touch is the seasoning salt stuff. This is the everything but the bagel sesame stuff. 
Dang. Okay, my camera's gonna die. I'm gonna eat this till next time. Five minutes later. Well, that was fast. I'm back literally five minutes later. I'm still kind of hungry, not gonna lie, even though I just had two pieces of toast. So, I'll show you guys my favorite snacks. These fruit snacks are really good. I'm pretty sure they're like vegan and organic, so they sound kind of weird, but they are so freaking good. <laughs> heaven made and heaven sent. These are definitely probably my favorite snacks. My other favorite snack, this popcorn, dank. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've ever done that in the whole world and I just got it on camera, so. Oh my God, I'm good. So this is the last thing I'm gonna eat for like a minute just because I'm gonna go to the gym and I like to like not eat like an hour, hour and a half before I go to the gym or else it just makes my stomach feel weird. I will see you probably in the car on the way to the gym because I wanna insert some clips of me into gym and stuff because I get a lot of questions about the gym and how I work out and stuff like that. Thought I might as well, might as well include it in this video. So yeah, see you when I go to the gym. Little change of plans. I thought I was going to the gym, but I had to go to the car dealership first. I thought I would be there for maybe 20 minutes. I was there for like an hour and a half. So now it's like almost five and I'm pretty hungry and I don't like working out when I'm hungry because then I just get really shaky. I do have some footage that I really like that I took at the gym that I'm going to insert probably after this. So this gym footage isn't from today. It kind of shows you guys just overall what I do when I work out. I posted a picture of me working out on my Instagram story and a lot of people were asking me where my outfit was from so I'm gonna talk about that as well because as I mentioned earlier this video is sponsored by Fabletics. For a little snack I think I'm just gonna have a banana and some peanut butter because that just sounds good right now. I am gonna make that and then I will jump into the gym footage. I'm just gonna get a tablespoon of this peanut butter. This is the Earth Balance peanut butter. This is the crunchy one. I never, ever, ever have crunchy peanut butter, but for some reason, that's what my mom bought. Another thing I like dipping fruits and stuff in is this. This is the Wild Friends chocolate coconut peanut butter. Might have a little bit of this. I don't know. I'm kind of feeling peanut butter right now, so. <laughs> to pray to God that my camera does not fall right now or else I will be so sad. I'm in my parents' room right now because it has better lighting, but anyways, I wanted to talk about Fabletics a little bit more, who I said earlier were sponsoring this video. Why do I get winded so easily? When you first log onto Fabletics, you will take a really quick 60 second quiz to kind of find like your style and stuff. And from there, they will show you like a personalized showroom unique to your style which is really cool after you take the quiz there's a little box that pops up where you can enter your email address you should do that because if you do that you will get monthly discounts in your email and you can see all of the unreleased collections before anyone else so i'm going to show you guys some of my favorite pieces that i got from fabletics oh my god can you see evie <laughs> hi boo fabletics has a really good deal where you can get two pairs of leggings which is usually worth 99 dollars for 24 dollars by using my link i'm not gonna lie i really really like the way that like these clothes make my body look like i'm not the most confident person ever in my body but like i feel like these items really like flatter my body <laughs> Looking like Christmas. I got a ton of different high-waisted pairs of leggings. Oh my god, what is she doing? Be sure to click my link down below. Get everything while you can while it's all in stock. Everything that I am showing you right now. I'll put a little screen recording right here of how easy the site is to use. One thing I really like about the site is I usually only wear high-waisted leggings because, you know, it just holds everything in more. Um, it's really easy to find, like, all the different types of styles that you like. Low-rise leggings, um, more, like, cropped leggings, literally anything like that you can find super easily. They literally have everything from different shirts like I'm wearing right now to sports bras to leggings to socks to other accessories such as headbands, which I actually got, but it kind of looks weird on me because I, like, have bangs. So, like, thank you to Fabletics for sponsoring me. I really, really appreciate it. So, yeah. This looks so much better through my glasses than, like, through my eyes, like... I just made it to the gym and I realized I forgot my headphones so I'm still gonna go but last time I did this and I forgot my headphones I literally just went back home because um, it just sucked. I have a few tips for going to the gym. I first started coming to the gym maybe like a year and a half ago. Tip number one bring headphones, bring a water bottle, reusable one, always. Tip number three, no one cares what you're doing. Everyone is focused on themselves and doing their own workouts that if you are like embarrassed of what other people are like thinking of you working out, no one cares. Literally no one cares. I remember the first day that I 
went to the gym I was trying to use the stair machine and I like just didn't know how to work it and it was just really weird I had like a mini anxiety attack I was just so worried that like other people were like looking at me but then I like looked around and no one was looking at me at all everyone is so focused on themselves my next tip is to go with the plan like know what you're gonna be working out I've been like meaning to do like a workout routine literally for like a year but I've just never had a solid workout routine okay let's go in this is gonna kind of suck because I don't have headphones so I look like Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> So for my workout, I usually do like a mile or a mile and a half on the treadmill, just like walking. I'll maybe run like a tiny, tiny bit at the end. But I recently just got like a new workout app that I'm starting to use. So this was the, this was only like the second time that I used it, but I really, really, really liked it. So this was my leg day, you can call it. Um, but yeah. I'm halfway done and I'm so tired. Oh God, I'm dripping so tired. Dinner time. I have been craving a burrito, so I'm gonna make a burrito. I am a simple woman, what can I say? I added some of this like pico salsa stuff and then I always, always, always Always add taco sauce to my burritos because it just makes it really good. That was all for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you to Fabletics once again for sponsoring. I don't know. I know my meals aren't like super creative or anything, but I don't know. I like watching these anyway. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Much love.